Are you looking to build your dream body? Struggling to reach your goals? At Start Living Right Gym, we guarantee results. Personal training, tailored diet plans, fun and exciting classes, a bar with healthy food from Lily's Downtown, Kempai and Ely Coffee, an outdoor pool, laundry services by Pure Laundry, plus more. We have affordable packages that will transform your life. Start living right today and call us now for your free trial. Good morning, welcome to Get Fit. This is Maya Nassar Malouf. Today we're gonna do a full body workout using a kettlebell. Today's workout is also suitable for pregnant women to do. Just always check with your doctor before doing any exercise. Let's get started. We're gonna do some sumo squats with some biceps curls. So we're gonna train the back of our thighs, our inner thighs, and our bicep muscles. These are the bicep muscles at the same time. So take a wide step, point your toes out, hold the kettlebell with both hands, and we're gonna sit back as if we were sitting on a chair, stand up, and curl up. Do this 15 times at home. Repeat each exercise today three times. So we're combining muscle groups. Make sure you take a wide step so you really work your inner and outer thigh muscles. So sit back, keep your back straight, knees behind your toes, and curl at the same time. If you don't have a kettlebell at home, you can also use one dumbbell or one big water bottle. And curl. So we're gonna do seven exercises today. Keep your shoulders rolled back. Let's also face the mirror. So feet out, sit back, and curl. Let's do a couple more, then we're gonna change exercise. I'm not gonna be doing 15 because of lack of time today. And up, let's do our last one. Squat, knees behind your toes, and curl. So let's do our second exercise. We're gonna work on our chest, our shoulders, and our legs. Hold the kettlebell. We're gonna do a reverse lunge. Step back, come down to the ground, pass the kettlebell, and do the same thing on the other side. Step back, down to the ground, hold one second, and pass. So we're doing a reverse lunge with a pass. Keep breathing, do 15 on each side. So I'm in my last month of pregnancy and it's very highly recommended to exercise during pregnancy. It's not only good for you, it has many health benefits for the baby as well. So when you do the lunge, make sure your front knee is in a 90 degree angle and keep your knee behind your toe. Let's do a couple this way. So step back and pass. Let's do one more on each side. Then we're gonna do another exercise that trains our legs and also our lower back. All right, let's do the next one. We're gonna do some deadlifts. So stand shoulder width apart. You can do this with one kettlebell or with two dumbbells. Arch your back, come down to the ground and stand up all the way. So we're working our lower back and also the back of our thighs. Do 15 at home. Drop down as low as you can. Shoulder width apart. Arch your back. And come down to the ground. Repeat three times at home to complete today's workout. Keep your shoulders rolled back and drop down to the ground. Keep breathing. After this, we're gonna do an exercise that trains our back called single arm row. Let's do two more. So come down and up, last one. Down and up. So let's do our back now. We're gonna step back with one foot, hold the kettlebell and lift from the knee and raise your elbow back. We're gonna do this on both sides. So we're doing the right side now, do 15. After this, we're gonna do the left side. So remember, if you guys need help with your fitness journey, including diet plans, exercise programs, motivation classes, physiotherapy, I have a gym that can help you more called Start Living Right in Antilias. Just call the number that you see flashing on the screen throughout the segment. Let's do two more on this side. And one more. All right, let's do the other side now. So let's face the mirror. We're gonna put our palm on our leg. We're gonna lean forward 
And we're gonna lift from the knee and take our elbow back. Keep your elbow close to your body. You can also do this with one dumbbell, one water bottle if you don't have a dumbbell. And of course, with a kettlebell, you can get a kettlebell from any fitness store. They range in weight from light to heavy. Right now I'm using four kilos. So lift to the back and back down. Let's do two more. So make sure you do this on both sides and up. So let's do another exercise that trains our trapezius muscles, the muscles next to the neck and also our shoulders. We're gonna stand shoulder width apart, lift until we are level with our chin and then raise to the front, working our shoulders. So right now we're working our trapezius muscles, the muscles in the upper back, and now we're working our shoulders. So lift up, back down, and to the front. When you lift up to the front, lift until you are parallel to the ground. So do this 15 times, up, after this, we have two more exercises to go. We're gonna train our shoulders, and we're also gonna train our triceps, the muscles at the back of the arms. So to see more exercises that you can do at home, just check out my free website, startlivingright.com or startlivingright.net, or download my free mobile app by searching for Start Living Right as one word in your smartphone stores and you'll see diet plans and exercise programs. Let's do one more. Then we're gonna need the mat next, up and down. Let's get our mat. So we're just gonna need to kneel on the mat. We're gonna do some shoulder presses. So in this position, hold the kettlebell and simply raise it up above your head. So bring it right back down to the chest and up all the way. And when you lift it up, hold one second, come down nice and slow, take your time on the way down. So we're working our shoulders right now. You can also do this exercise standing up, but we're just doing another variation today. That's why we're kneeling on the ground, up and down. Let's also face the mirror. It's always a good idea to work out in front of a mirror. So on your knees, up and back down. So 15 times at home, use a nice slow and controlled movement. Remember, if you are pregnant, I highly advise you guys to exercise. If you need help staying fit during your pregnancy, come check out my gym. We can help you with an exercise program or a diet plan to keep you in shape and keep you and your baby healthy. Let's do one more. And up. So now we're gonna do our triceps. These are the triceps, the muscles at the back of the arm here. So we're gonna hold the kettlebell up above our head. Don't do this, keep your elbows still. And simply lower and raise. So you can also do this with one dumbbell if you don't have a kettlebell at home, although it's a very good idea to have a wide variety of equipment. So down behind your head and up. Let's also face the mirror to have another angle. So raise up, elbow still and close to your head. And do this 15 times. Remember 15 times and repeat three times at home. If you guys need help, contact me via social media, Instagram Maya Nassar Fitness, Snapchat Nassar Maya, or check out my Facebook page called Start Living Right. So lower behind your head and up. You're gonna feel the burn in your triceps, the muscles at the back of the arm. Let's do one more. Down all the way and up. So that's it for today, we've run out of time. Thank you so much for training with me. Remember, if you need help with your fitness journey, contact Start Living Right Gym. You can call the number directly on 764-996-999. Have a great weekend, and I'll see you guys on Tuesday at 10.